Turn your outdoor outlets into smart power outlets with this device. Let's check it out. Dave Taylor here and I'm just about to start putting up some of my holiday lights to make my house more festive and this is a great thing to do. But what I don't want to have to do when I'm done is I don't want to have to turn on and off or plug and unplug those lights every time I want to have control over them. Enter this. This is one of a category of devices that are called outdoor smart plugs and they are game changers. This is the Ministon Matter outdoor smart plug and Matter is really important because Matter is actually a sort of global open source standard for smart home devices because all the vendors heard from all of us consumers who said we don't want to have 50 different apps and all these things be incompatible. So this by using Matter is future proof which is really important but it also means that it works with Alexa, Apple Home, Google Home, and Samsung SmartThings. So all of those, it'll just integrate into their systems without any further hassle. Don't have a hub for any of those? That's okay, you don't need a hub because you can also just use their Smart Life app and that actually controls a variety of different things from multiple vendors. And I'll show you how that all works. I'll configure this in just a minute. But I wanna tell you this is a three-prong outlet and you see that on the end and it is up to 15 amps and it's Wi-Fi enabled. So this little guy actually has a lot of smarts inside of it. It also, very importantly, is IP65 waterproof. So I wouldn't have it sitting inside your pond, but if it's outside and it gets rained or snowed on, that's not going to be a problem. And that's pretty darn important. One more thing is there is a override switch here, that little white button. So you push it on, push it off, so you can override your programming. But enough talking, let me plug it in. Just happen to have an extension cord here. And so right off the bat, you can see that the light turns on and off and now it's in pairing mode. That's why it's blinking. So let's go ahead and pair this with my app and I'll let you see how easy that is. So you want to look for the Smart Life app if you don't have any of those other utilities out there. That's okay. So I'm going to just open it up and you can see that it has instantly seen this new device. How easy is that? So I'm going to press add and that looks good. So now I will have it being added and notice that there's that little progress circle. I'm just going to jump forward so I don't have to watch it slowly handshake. And we're done. That's easy enough. So now done. And it says power off. So now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to plug in some completely tangled but still functional holiday lights. So I'm going to do that. You can see it's all very easy to do. And then I'm going to turn it on. There we go. And then I'm going to turn it off. That's like 95% of the functionality right there. So nice. Now let's program something. So I'm going to go into timer and then I'm going to add schedule and at, let's see, 5.30 p.m. every night. Let's go to 5.30 on every single night. I'm going to have the switch turn on, which will turn on my holiday, festive holiday lights. So I'm going to choose save and takes a moment or two to show up sometimes, but it'll show up here. And then I'm going to go and add a second schedule. So we already have that one there. And now I'm going to say at 1130 PM, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven at 1130 PM, I want to actually have everything turn off. So we'll confirm that and I'll press save again. And there you go. So both of them are there. And now you can see that at 5.30 p.m. every day, the switch will turn on and all my lights will turn on. And then at 11.30 p.m. every night, they will turn off. Now, 
That's pretty darn easy. That's all I have to do. And there are some settings so you can do things like change the name of the device. I think that's the pencil icon on the top right. So you can see here that I can integrate it in with all of my other smart home systems. I can turn on and off notifications. So if I really want to get confirmation, I could actually get a notification while I'm out of town or still at the office or out for dinner that just says holiday lights turned on. So if that's your thing, you can do that. Now, again, what's worth noting is that this is a Wi-Fi based control system, which means as long as this stays online and it has a really good range, it works perfectly fine in my testing, then as long as you're online, you can turn it on and off from a thousand miles away. You could literally be around the world <laughs> and someone can say, hey, do me a favor, turn off your holiday lights. It's really annoying. And you can be like, okay, boop, 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 boom. And they turn off even though you're not home. Tell me that's not great. So it is a really nice device. And now you can see I can override it with that button and I can leave it in this state. So when 5.30 rolls around, it'll turn on. It's already on, so it's fine. It'll just say, okay, I guess that was just an override. I can also turn them back off and it's showing it would actually have updates on the app that match and parallel what I just did. So that's everything. It's really easy to control, really easy to pair. It's really easy to schedule. This is a game changer for you with anything that you have outside that you have powered up. And this could include having like a fire pit if you want one where you want to just have it on or outside lights or holiday lights. There's a lot of different use cases for this. And of course, you can also use it indoors. So you could use this for your Christmas tree if you want, and then just know that the device you got can also go outside if you decide that you wanna use it differently next year. And that's really great flexibility. Most importantly, that matter compatibility means that it's going to be just as functional in five years when all these companies have changed all their standards and specs, it'll still work just fine. That's the benefit of the matter global open source standard. So definitely one to check out absolute game changer for people who want to have something festive happening. <laughs> Hopefully with better and more exciting lights than these. These are looking a little tired. That's a separate story. Now, we do need to talk price. Before we get there, I'm going to invite you to subscribe to my channel. Click or tap on that subscribe button. Hit that bell icon for notifications. Give me a thumbs up if you found this of value. I certainly hope that you did. Excellent. This, let me unplug this part at least. This is the Ministon Matter Outdoor Smart Plug. It is $17.99 currently with a 15% discount, dropping it down to a ridiculous $15.29 at Amazon.com. For $15, bucks, this is a no-brainer addition. And if you really wanted to, you could plug in a sort of splitter or something. They have very short extension cords where you plug in one and it gives you two or three plugs. And then you could have a multitude of different outside lighting and outside things all control automated as part of your smart home. Absolute win. I need to get this back outside, so I'll have to catch you in my next video.